Anyone that fishes the west coast knows the Shogun is one of the premier long-range boats running out of Fisherman's Landing in San Diego. Owner-operator Frank Lopresti and Captain Aaron Barnhill along with second captain Russ Braswell make a team that combines decades of long-range experience with a tenacious drive to be the best in the business. The Shogun was designed and built by Ted Dunn in 1989 and at 90 feet long and a wide 30 foot beam, she's one of the most stable platforms in her class. As the guys get their gear loaded on this cloudy and rainy morning, the anticipation in the air is thick. Most of the anglers on this trip haven't seen the island in over a decade, and the reports from Guadalupe have been outstanding. The Shogun is one of only a handful of boats that has secured permits to fish the island and these lucky few have the golden ticket and are more than ready to get reacquainted with the splendor that is Guadalupe Island. We get all excited coming down here. It's kind of, kind of like the carrot dangling in front of you. You see the island from a long ways away and you get a lot of anticipation and excitement getting there. So we're all rigged up, ready to go, and getting impatient, ready to get down there and do some fishing. Pretty much we just go up into shallower water, about 60 fathoms, and we just uh, start sweeping our way down, um, just looking for any signs of fish. It could be just a few scattered fish we stop on, or like in the afternoon, they do build up in some pretty decent schools. And then uh, throw a chum line on them, if they boil up, then we'll kick the anchor over and give it a try. If it doesn't look like they want to react, they keep swimming by, then we'll just keep looking for another one. But uh, typically, it's been pretty good in the afternoon. The fish are willing and ready to go if you find some. Our water's still over 70 degrees. We've got beautiful weather, and uh, we'll see once we get down here if we have any current. It is current dependent. Usually when there's no current, the fish are a little bit more inactive, barely boil around. But when you get a decent tide going, the fish really turn on and start biting. Good promise, you. Yeah, but I dropped the anchor. Yeah, but I dropped the anchor. Go ahead, Jeff. Tell him I got one. He's got one. <laughs> oh, he's taking all my line away, man. That's wrong. You told me 60 was enough. Oh, hook up. There's a biter. Not enough angler. Tommy Hill, what are you doing, man? I don't know. We're gonna see if Luke's uh, tournament knots are any good here now. Yeah. This one's leaving with all of my line. It's 
one got bigger. Yeah, I've heard of this one. Yeah, you guys can go ahead and switch. It's all fun. starting to plunk away here. Fish is gathering up on us and I think we've got four or five going so it looks like things are developing well and yeah hopefully we get a little bit more current here and they keep biting. So good start. Good start. Right starting on. to bite. Stop it, is he? Oh, it just popped. Oh, Bummer. Bummer. Sorry,